New at 5, we're learning a St. George couple killed by a suspected drunk semi-truck driver was newly engaged. That crash happened in Nevada just this past weekend. Three motorcyclists who died in the crash were all from St. George. KUTV's Amanda Gilbert is live with what we've learned today and a message from law enforcement. Amanda. Guys, family and friends tell me that Owen Hart and Athena Taylor died after they had just gotten engaged Christmas of last year. But take a look at your scene. This is the scene of the crash in Nevada. And Nevada Highway Patrol says the driver, Claude Rafiki, is accused of being impaired and driving the wrong way. Reports say his semi truck crossed into the wrong lane and he hit two motorcycles. He faces multiple charges. The three motorcyclists who were killed include that couple that had just gotten engaged along with their friend Jeremy Gibo. Now I spoke with our own Utah Highway Patrol. They are not connected to this case. This happened in a different state, but they say cases like this, a suspected impaired semi truck driver. This is something we don't see a lot. You've got such a big vehicle traveling and the last thing you want to ha have is an impaired driver. We really try to put strict requirements on our uh, people who drive commercially uh, just because of the, the liability and the risks that associated with that. And I know tonight the St. George community is really rallying behind loved ones of those who were killed. There's a local restaurant, 100% of their tips are going to loved ones. Also, there is an online fundraiser that's getting a lot of attention. We're working on getting that on our news app. Amanda Gilbert, KUTV, 2 News.